Centers for Music mogul Sean Diddy Combs are expected to file an appeal today after Combs was ordered held without bail after his indictment on sex crimes. Now, Combs pleaded not guilty to the charges yesterday. Christina Pham joins us live from federal court in Lower Manhattan with the latest on this disturbing case. Christina? Well, Chris and Mary, the appeal hearing is scheduled for 3.30 this afternoon. Yesterday, a judge denied bail after federal prosecutors successfully argued that Combs posed a flight risk and could also potentially intimidate witnesses. The defense, meanwhile, vehemently denied those accusations, saying that their client is looking forward to clearing his name in court. 54-year-old Sean Diddy Combs was led away in handcuffs Tuesday afternoon after being denied bail. His attorney immediately vowed to appeal. He's a fighter and he's going to fight this. The once global music superstar was charged with sex trafficking, racketeering, and interstate transportation for prostitution following a months-long Homeland Security investigation. Federal prosecutors allege he created a criminal enterprise that forced women to engage in sex acts with professional sex workers at events he called freak-offs for his own personal entertainment. The freak-offs sometimes lasted days at a time involved multiple commercial sex workers and often involved a variety of narcotics. Prosecutors say Combs was violent towards the woman, alleging he hit, kicked, threw objects at, and dragged victims at times by their hair. The indictment also refers to an incident caught on hotel security cameras in 2016, which shows Combs attacking his ex-girlfriend, the singer Cassie. A member of the hotel security staff intervened and Combs attempted to bribe the staff member with a stack of cash to make sure that what happened was kept quiet. And while raiding his Miami and Los Angeles homes earlier this year, federal investigators say they were able to uncover guns, ammunition, drugs, and more than a thousand bottles of baby oil and lubricant. If found guilty on all three federal counts, Combs faces a minimum of 15 years to life behind bars. Reporting live from Lower Manhattan, Christina Fan. CBS News New York. Tina, thank you. Be sure to stay with CBS News New York as more information comes out on this arrest. To read the full unsealed indictment, go to CBSNewYork.com.